I'm Sarah Birch with Kingsness News and here are your top headlines today, June 20th, 2024. On the morning of Wednesday, June 19th, healthcare professionals from Kingston Health Sciences Center had reason to smile thanks to the presentation of a check for $177,413 from the Tim Horton Smile Cookie Campaign. The money will support child and youth mental health programs at KHSC. Smile Cookie funds from last year were used to purchase comfort and treatment items such as weighted blankets, therapy workbooks, art supplies, fidget spinners, specialized toys, and other sensory items. The Kingston Brain Tumor Community, in support of the Brain Tumor Foundation of Canada, is thrilled to announce its partnership with the Kingston Grenadiers for a special event at Richardson Stadium this weekend. On Saturday, June 22, 2024, two Kingston Grenadier football games will be played, and the event will honor the memory of Queen's University and Grenadiers football coach Dale Sands, who passed away tragically from a brain tumor. This event will also celebrate the resilience and courage of brain tumor survivors in our community. Kingston Police closed a section of Princess Street yesterday at 2 p.m. from Portsmouth Avenue to Sir John A. Macdonald Boulevard after a serious motor vehicle collision involving a pedestrian. Approximately an hour later, police confirmed on social media that a pedestrian was involved and transported to hospital with serious injuries. On Tuesday, June 18, 2024, the Algonquin and Lakeshore Catholic District School Board welcomed local representatives to J.J. O'Neill Catholic School to acknowledge and celebrate the groundbreaking at the new school site located at 240 Maryland Avenue in Napanee. Members of the board, the parent council, and school and administration staff joined dignitaries and members of the press to officially break ground for construction. A vehicle stolen in Kingston last month was recovered by the Upper Ottawa Valley Detachment of the OPP over the weekend. At approximately 5.30 a.m. on Saturday, June 15th, police were notified of an abandoned vehicle on an ATV trail just off Rollins Road in the Ottawa Valley. Patrol officers attended and located the stolen vehicle, which was a black Ford pickup. Anyone with information regarding this incident is asked to contact the Upper Ottawa Valley Detachment of the OPP at 613-735-0188. On Tuesday, June 18, 2024, Kingston City Council received a report on the possible nighttime whistle cessation for trains, which was debated intensely and then carried on down the line. The report, which can be read full on the City of Kingston website, explains that while a few areas throughout the city meet the requirements for a whistle cessation, some of those are only in one direction. For more on this story and other local news, visit kingstonist.com and subscribe. Use my code SARAHB2024 for 10% off.